one, Cayman Reynolds here, and what we have right here is the Mountain Camp Sugar Method. It's a quick, easy way to emergency feed your bees. You can do it at very low temperatures. We're in the 50s right now. It's almost the new year. But for those of you who are experiencing freezing temperatures even during the daytime, you can uh, still get into your hives really quick and do this. It's not going to hurt the bees. So all you got to do is get you a sheet of newspaper like this, and you're going to spritz it down just a little bit enough to get it barely moist. Don't get it sopping wet. And you don't even have to do the edges, just where the sugar is going to be. And that's going to help the bees be able to eat through it a little bit quicker. Then you're going to put about an inch or so of sugar, and you're going to spritz that down a little bit. Now, using regular water is fine. I like one-to-one -one sugar syrup in my little sprayer over here, and that way it adds a little bit more sugar content to it. And then you're going to add the rest of it and make like a mountain type shape. You can smooth it down, do all kinds of stuff, put thank you bees or you're awesome or encouraging notes. You can do it. You can make it through the winter. All that kind of fun stuff. Or Cayman was here. That's my favorite. Um, anyways, you can spritz that top a little bit. And as that moisture um, gets in through that sugar and the moisture from the hive, it's going to turn the whole thing into a brick. So for those of you who are thinking about using the sugar bricks method, I really don't like it. It's such a pain to make those sugar bricks. You gotta stick them in your oven. You gotta wait so long to do it. This, I'm gonna wait 45 seconds. And it does the same thing. I actually think it does better. And as that just turns into a hard rock candy mountain, is that a song? Those bees can just eat through that and eat through it all winter. You can check them about a month later or so and see how much they've eaten. They might have eaten very little of it. They might have eaten all of it. So this is a great emergency way of taking care of your bees in the winter months, even in cold, cold temperatures. We prefer you feed them in the fall when it's warm enough to use liquid feed, but this is a great emergency way of feeding bees, and they've been doing it for over 100 years, just not calling it the Mountain Camp Sugar Method. Thanks for watching our video, and we'll see you next year.